This is Weimar Armour, a 57 foot semi traditional narrowboat built in 1996 by Stenson and fitted up by Midland Canal Centre. They built a lot of boats and a nice job they do. She's named after a seaside village on the Northern Island in New Zealand in Hawke's Bay. And we sold her just a year ago in July 2018. She had a full survey in July last year. That's available for inspection and threw up nothing of concern. Good sized well deck, four feet six inches long. The gas locker is in the bows there. And there's a storage locker stroke seat at the front of the well deck rather unusually than normally down the sides. Nice hardwood glazed front doors. And into the boat we go. She's fitted out an oak face ply. Feels very lovely. There's an L-shaped dinette, or rather sofa here. That turns into a bed, the storage underneath. In the corner is a more so squirrel stove. Nice condition. Storage under that step there and a stereo and television in the corner. That's a TV and DVD combination. There's a satellite dish that comes with that. The stereo pipes music through the boats. The speakers in here, as you can see, and the... Um, in the bedroom. Radiator, the central heating is an Eberspacher system running off the diesel. And here's the Danette, Pullman style, it turns into another double berth. There's a privacy curtain in between the L shaped sofa and the Danette. So you can sleep six on this boat. Into the galley, lots of storage in here. The saloon, by the way, was 11 feet long, the Danette six feet six. Head height on the bed on the boat is six feet six. Squeaky clean oven. It's a vanette system and grill, four burner gas hob. And a nice side hatch next to the uh, next to the cooker with some steps. But easy exit. And there's a hatch in the roof there that folds back, which gives you additional light and air. On the port side, cupboards, shelves. The fridge is underneath here, that's a LEC 12 volt with an icebox, and the stainless steel sink is next to it. A couple of good sized cupboards underneath that. The galley's over, well, nearly 8 feet long, 7 feet inches, uh, 7, 7 feet 10 inches. There's the view down from the galley. Quick reverse back through. Lovely boat, lots of space, very social boat. You can see seat a lot and sleep a lot. There's another radiator. Into the bathroom. Three quarter length bath. There's a basin there. That's set over a vanity and, and the loo itself is a dometic pump through a uh, dump through pump out toilet. Floor to ceiling cupboard here on the way down to the bedroom. Useful hanging space. Another radiator in the bedroom at the end. Here's the bed, six feet long, six feet four inches long rather. Storage underneath, the calorifies under there as well. Some neat little drawers tucked at the end and a full size wardrobe here. That's got the inverter in as well there. The inverter itself is a 1.8 kilowatt sterling. That pumps 230 volts through the boat as well as a landline if you have access. Onto the back deck, some very comfortable perch seats either side. And the engine is a Lister LPWS4. There's only, well, just short of 2,000 hours on the clock. Regularly serviced. And the storage in the bench on the left there. Let's have another, another walk back through. I've mentioned the survey in 2018. She was last blacked in September 2017. Serviced in July 2018. She comes with all the usual and necessary navigation equipment. And there's a tonneau cover as well that goes over the rear deck there. When she's been left for a little while, it keeps the rain out of the engine room. Lovely boat. Well looked after. Room for lots of people to eat and sleep. 
Weimarama. For further photographs of fully downloadable colour brochure and the price, go to our website www.rugbyboats.co.uk.